Let's go. What's going on everybody? Claudio Zavala Jr. here and welcome back. Today I'm going to try to be very quick and just share with you one tip here that I use when I'm editing my photos using Lightroom. Now you can do this in the desktop app as well as on your mobile phone. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump in there. So here I have four images that I took. This is of a senior photo session I did a long while back, but I wanted to go back in and do some editing of it. And so I picked these four images that are fairly similar. I'm going to just jump in here and do some quick editing on this image right here. And so I can adjust the exposure a bit, maybe bring it down some, raise up the contrast and let's check out the highlights, work on some of the shadows, bring them up or down. Let's check out the whites here. So I'll do some just editing of the image and kind of get it too close to where I want it to be and see if I want it to change the temperature there. I do remember this was an early morning so it was a little bit chill. I should say a little bit chilly and let's bring out some of the vibrance there. Get it to where as close as I want it to be. Let's see. and some clarity there you may not be able to tell so much in the video but um it is working here some sharpening and let's see i'm not gonna worry too much on optics here and let me go back up here to temperature what if i wanted to give it kind of a kind of a cool color tone like that so if I bring it down all the way, it'll be blue, but I don't want that much. Just maybe bring it down some. Um, just kind of give it a cooler tone to it. Maybe I can bring up some of the aquas, blue. So now I can come over here to the right hand side on those three dots and choose copy edit settings or use command C on a Mac. I believe control C on a PC. And then come on over to the image here, over to the right. Paste settings, boom. Do the same thing here. Paste settings and one more. Bam. Now all of those images look similar. They have the same uh, exposure, contrast, tone, any sharpening I've done. This trick right here has saved me tons of time. Instead of having to edit every single little image, I can just do one of those photos copy those settings and apply it to the other ones. As long as those photos have similar backgrounds, locations, lighting, etc., this right here saves you tons of time. The same thing works on the Lightroom mobile app. You can copy settings and apply it to the other ones. Really cool. Let me know what you thought about this tip. If you have any other Lightroom tips, please do add it in the comment section below. If you learned something new and uh, enjoyed this video, please Give it two thumbs up by clicking on that like button below. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on those notifications. Keep shooting those wonderful photos, everyone. Until next time, peace. I